A burglar striking an organization helping men, women and children. As reporter Julian Para shows us, the search is on for the people who stole thousands from the group, leaving few clues behind. Dr. Gianna Desai with the Albuquerque Speech Language Hearing Center says something seemed off when valuable iPads and a computer went missing. We were likely broken into at some point and a lot of our equipment was stolen. Equipment used to help detect hearing defects in children. She and her staff wondering how this could have happened if no damage seemed to be done to the office. We've all just been a little bit disheartened, I would say because we no longer have equipment for these certain specialized appointments. Dr. Desai says someone or a group of people likely hid somewhere in their office space, scavenging the entire area and stealing over $20,000 worth of equipment. The nonprofit has contacted police to report the crime, but with no cameras around to record what happened and no damage to report, she says this case is hard to investigate. Until they hear back from police, she says doorknobs have been replaced, locks have been switched, and cameras are soon to be installed. Most importantly, Desai says the main goal is to get back what they can to help the community they serve. It's so important for us to be able to diagnose early on so that we can manage it and treat it as it progresses or as it changes, whatever that patient may need. As they figure out what to do now, Desai says their plan is to try and move forward the best they can. Right now, just pushing things back and hoping that we can replace them in a timely manner and be able to get people back in for these types of appointments. In Albuquerque, I'm Julian Paras reporting.